Do you want to learn how to make an outfit for the spooky times? Considering on how Halloween is just around the corner, I decided to make both a historical accurate outfit for Halloween. Here is H.H. H. Holmes. Now, I tried to create him as close as I can, so here's the best I could do. H.H. H. Holmes always wears himself his favorite hat, which is a ball, which is a baller hat, a brawler hat, painted black. Now, this is the closest I could get it, so in if you want, you can do modifications, any, any way to make this outfit look a little bit better. No eyewear, no mask, obviously, no bandana, but the neckwear. Now, that is where I decided to wear the dress tie. I tried to find something in his pattern, but I really couldn't, so I just went on with the black, with the straight up black dress tie. Now coats. Now the coats is is where I see that you can make the most variety. You can wear a duster coat painted black. I just had to go with the roller jacket. You can also go with the morning with the ta with the tail coat, but that requires four gold to purchase. And if you do not have some, you can just use the roller outfit. Next are the next are the vest. Now the vest I tried to find the closest thing as I could, but the one I found that looked the best was the Paisley jacket or vest jacket. In my opinion, it looks more, it just looks better, it just looks better, and it looks like the only good one. Now the shirt, now the shirt is actually going to be the easiest thing, which is going to be the everyday shirt. You could use the French, the French dress shirt to make it a little bit brighter, but I decided to go with the everyday shirt, just because it looks a little bit better, and plus it's going to be hiding. No suspenders, no gloves, no rings unless you actually want to make it. Now, this is actually where I will say this. The outfit, unfortunately, you cannot get rid of the guns, so I would recommend you just normally wear these. Uh, let me just get rid of the buckle. Pants are the clerk pants, because in every single one, he looks like he's wearing like a full-on tuxedo. You could also use the tuxedo pants, but I feel like that's a little bit too fancy, so I just went with the clerk pants, painted black. No chaps. And the boots? Well, you can, well, again, a variety of ones. You can wear the... Milk right or the tuxedo. I decided to go with the milk, uh, the mill right, milk right, the mill right boots. No spurs. All right, and that's how you I make H. H. Holmes. At least in my, uh, I know people are probably gonna make a better design of it, and I'm actually personally wanting to see what people can make. But for Halloween, this could be a good, good outfit for you and your friends to mess around with. Thank you for watching. And I'll see y'all later.